Well, we continue our coverage of the coronavirus and the impact it is having on us here in the Miami Valley with Governor DeWine's stay-at-home order going into effect at 11.59 p.m. tonight. There are a lot of questions on how local law enforcement will be enforcing it. We have Montgomery County Sheriff Rob Streck now live on the phone. Hopefully, give us just a second here to, to provide us some of those answers. Uh, Sheriff, I understand you spoke with Governor DeWine last night or the night before. What's the overall approach? Yeah, the overall approach is, is like many have said, uh, the goal is, is hopefully that our citizens understand uh, to stay at home. The approach is, is, is warnings try to explain to people why they need to be home. And then once again, if, if there is an order in effect and if, if somebody's ignoring those warnings or, or doing something uh, that we get called to be there, then we, we will enforce it. I heard you mention in one of the earlier news conferences that some people have reached out to you, whether calling you or, or emailing, giving you hypotheticals, asking you, well, if I did this, then what would happen? And you had a message for those people. Yeah, the message was just, just trying to, just quit trying to, to, to play the system. Just listen to the health professionals. Stay at home unless you need food or gas or to check on loved ones. But stay at home, and, and that way, eventually, all of our lives will get back to normal. And I know the governor has mentioned several times this stay at home order really looks very similar to what he has hoped we've been doing up until this point. It's just gone from a strong recommendation to an official order. But we do probably need to ask about worst case scenario here. Are we talking about arrests if someone refuses to comply? Uh, there's always arrest. Hopefully it don't come to that. I think most agencies would, would look at uh, alternative means as far as summons or citations. But yeah, if, if you get the right situation and the right set of circumstances, somebody could be arrested. Okay, and then just uh, as we get ready to wrap up here, Sheriff, final words to people at home from your department. I, I think it's just um, everybody, the, the professionals are telling us to stay at home and it's time we, we do that. All right, thank you so much.